Yeah, so welcome to my let's play of Donkey Kong Country for the SNES. Um, well, I've played this before. I just felt like I have to create some kind of video to start things off. I'm, I've gotten a bit s s slacky, or how I should say it. Um, you know, summer and... Uh, I've just not played that many games and in particularly not, uh, you know, <laughs> recording anything. But hey, uh, me. Um, so yeah, basically Donkey Kong and his uh, friend Diddy Kong is searching for his stash of bananas that evil crocodiles have stolen. Or so the story tells us. Well, never mind that. Uh, <laughs> the story maybe isn't the best part of this game. Rather, I would say the music and the graphics for its time, of course. And no, I won't be doing every secret in this game because I'm actually not that good at, you know, I'm not a completionist, I don't really go for finding everything. But I do try and find at least a few of them, I guess. As long as the maps aren't too hard. This first one I at least know two secrets, I think. This is, this is the first one, which is a bunch of bananas. And a wanna. Yeah, many people seem to like Diddy Kong more than Donkey Kong and many even thinks that Donkey Kong doesn't have a purpose in this game but I I wouldn't really go as far to say that because even if Diddy Kong is faster and stuff you know Donkey Kong he can actually jump on the larger enemies um, and kill them while Diddy Kong can't so I think they, you know, they kind of help each other out. Both can do their special kind of thing. Uh, this is the end of the map, I believe. I'm go just going to check if there's something over here. Oh. I'm horrible at jumping in this game. Uh. Yeah, I found me some bananas and a one-up. Awesome. So that's the first level. Not too shabby, I'd say. Uh, sorry. Thing. So, let's continue. Um, let's continue on to Ropey Rampage. Rampage. <coughs> yeah. So let's check this out because this looks like a secret ish. No? Maybe I'm just doing it wrong. Never mind, I'm not really caring that much for secrets but I do want to get the letters the letters give you one ups I believe I don't like those things so I'm going to ignore them for the most part oh my controller get jam gets uh, jammed up sometimes I don't know why but I can't really control the jumps perfectly I don't know why Never mind, I'll probably get used to this. I usually do get to uh, get used to controllers, which is a bit broken. This one's pretty old, I'm probably going to change it uh, before my next episode or so, I, so I don't... 
I'm not sure, but I think I will change it at least, because it gets kind of obnoxious after a while when the controller doesn't work properly. So now we're going for some rope swinging action. Or die, that's also one way of playing the game. Um, I'm pretty proficient in, in that one. Let's, let's try and do it the right way though. Because my way maybe isn't the optimal one, but yeah, you know. So let's try this again and hope my controller don't fuck it up. Or me as being, you know, clumsy like that time. Oh no you don't. Oh! Ah, uh, 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 how? Ooh. Now I'm just playing bad. I need to be much more careful. So yeah. Uh, and that was that, as they say. Nay! Hey, no! <laughs> I missed that letter. Oh my. Oh well. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Let's, let's check up what Cranky's Cabin is all about. You big ape. I could hear you coming from miles away. Aye, that was where we had real gameplay. That was. And this was developed with the latest state of the art 3D work thing is, was it? The trouble with you kids is that you're all too soft. The old games were far harder when I was a young un. We used to play for hours on a single screen game and think we were lucky, and we were. You wouldn't last two minutes in a real game. The craft, the croc, copus corners is croc, the collectibles in coral capers, steel cakes are indestructible, follow them and they'll mow down all baddies in their path. There's too many baddies around for my liking. I'm off to lie down. So I guess <laughs> Yeah, I guess he lectured us about games. Oh well, let's at least take one more level before we end this episode. Uh, and see what I can do. See what I can do, as they say. So yeah. Well, that was... I feel that this might get a bit tricky. <laughs> I'm not up to par with this. Not right now. It was a few years back since I played the, this game, actually. So yeah, this is a secret, secret thingy. I think. Or just a bonus level, I don't know what they call it. Well, yeah, we got the Mr. Big back. Yeah, that's that's good. Good old DK. DK as decaying? Hmm. I hope not. So let's see. Uh, sneaky action. Crawly, crawly. Um, Yes, a checkpoint. That's awesome. That's. Uh, I don't like these bees, and that one's indestructible. I believe. I believe the yellow ones can be killed with barrels. Uh, I'm not going to talk about other YouTubers when saying barrels. I'm just going to leave it at that. That joke's been made so many times before, so. Let's see. Uh, sorry, my concentration is a bit high. Yeah, jumping on snakes, that's always fun and good. Fun and games. Uh, I've always loved the sounds the crocodiles make. Like, <laughs> I've always thought that was funny. Well, maybe should I, should I take one more? I take one more level. I take one more level. Just for the heck of it, for you guys. 
Let's see. I don't really like uh, uh, water levels. I guess most people don't, but I guess the music's kind of good in this game, in, in the water levels at least. I mean, it doesn't redeem that it is a water level, but it makes it, you know, a little bit more... Yeah, you, you see what I mean. It feels better. Uh, let's see now, how does this one steer? Oh god, my controller can only move in one direction at one time. I believe that is because this controller is broken. That's not good. That will prove to be a difficult thing. I want that life a little bit too much, maybe. Come on. Yes, I got everything back. Let's go down. Some fishes. Oh, a checkpoint. Yeah, I thought that maybe I would uh, do one more level. Mainly because I hate water levels and the faster I get to complete them, the better. I guess. I don't have to do this one the next time I play. Whoop! That wasn't even on purpose. Does he do that automatically sometimes? I'm not sure. Hmm. Whatever that's supposed to be. Alright, I survived this so far. So yeah, he seems to be attacking automatically. I I haven't even been thinking about it um, the last time I played this game. Not that it matters though uh, that much. I would probably survive. That's that! That's Coral Capers! So yeah! That's the first episode of Donkey Kong Country for the SNES and uh, thank you for watching! Uh, rate, comment and subscribe if you're interested in more videos like this. And uh, there will be more next time! Bye!